We're back at Albon. I've got Bernadette just got off stage talking about sales and stories. Bernadette, welcome back to Albon. How'd you oh, feel the keynote? Thank you. Oh, it's awesome. The energy out there is fantastic. Like it's, uh, yeah, really, really pumped at the moment. <laughs> so let, let's talk a little bit about the content you put out. I know it was special, you, stories and everything. This, can you elaborate? Give us a couple of takeaways from it. Yeah. So, um, you know, I, a couple of stories that I shared, um, uh, and it really does come back to the fact that stories will sell more because they tap into the emotional. I didn't go into this on the uh, on the keynote, but I'm giving this to you. Tell the virtual audience. <laughs> I'm giving this happen. to you guys. When you tell a story, right, you you actually get hooked into it. So it's, it's got to be relevant, though. So a really good business story is actually going to allow your prospect or your buyer to infer so much more about you. They're going to infer more about your character, more about your value, that more than an argument or a brochure or a pitch. Sure. Do. So it really comes back to the fact that um, we've got to realize that at every point of, of the um, sales process, we can share a story that is relevant, that helps our buyer buy in to what we're, what we're selling. Now, you just came off an emotional high on the stage, right? And I know it was a, it was a 20, 25-minute presentation. This is the question here. You can answer how you want. If I could send you right back out there again, was, was, was there anything that you would have changed? Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Absolutely nailed it as far as I'm concerned. Okay. I, I loved so, it. That's what we like to hear. I loved hear. it. And, you know, the thing is you're there to share ideas to help the audience become better at, at their job. And sometimes, you know, people might have heard an idea before, or sometimes it's a fresh idea. It doesn't matter so long as they leave and take action on it. Take action. And speaking of action, you've got another uh, workshop you're doing on Friday. Let's talk a little bit about that for our virtual audience. Oh, cool. Um, yeah, so it's a, um, it's a masterclass with the sales leaders. It's on the transformational sales leader. Um, what I'm going to, you know, take them through there is um, a model that I've created. It's kind of like an aspirational model. I call it the um, the impact and revenue model. And we're going to go through the five different types of sales leaders, um, you know, all the way down the, from the uh, the micromanager right the way up to the courageous sales leader and the, and the sorts, the, the different levels in between. And then what we're going to do is we're going to actually help those sales leaders to sell a strategy to their sales team. So we're going to look at creating a story. Um, around communicating strategy and selling change. You're unpacking a lot right there. We look I'm forward. Sorry, guys, you know, I'm kind of like, yeah. <laughs> we're looking forward. We're looking forward to Friday's workshop. Is there any parting shots that you would like to add for our virtual audience before we wrap this up? You know what? I'm just super glad that you guys are investing in your development because um, we, you know, things are changing so quickly today. We need to grab hold of any little insight, any little nugget that we can find. And of course, that's not you know, the same for everybody, but just, you know, a couple of things that if you just act on those, um, so well done for being here and connect with me, you know, I'd love to connect with you. Thank you so much, Bernadette and Outbound 2022. We thank you. Thank you. Have a good day, guys.